Hey there, Andrew. This is Brandon. Uh, just sending over that short video I promised you. Uh, in this video, I'm going to go over three things that you can do today to help bring uh, more customers to your business. Uh, you might be wondering what the heck does uh, you know this do for me? Uh, but what I'm finding out is a lot of small businesses just don't have the time to go in there and do this kind of stuff because you guys are busy, you know, being hands-on with the actual you know business and out there working. Um, so this works out for me if you find this stuff relevant. You know, you can reach back out to me. I can certainly give you a hand with it. And if not, you can take these tips and tricks. And if you find time, implement them uh, yourself um, and hopefully, you know, position yourself a little bit better than you are now and bring some more customers in and ultimately make more money. Because I think that's, uh, you know, why you're in business. Um, the three things I'm going to show you here, Andrew, are uh, first one being content. The second one is citations. And the third one is backlinking. So the first thing I look at on a website like yours right here, um, is your content and Google looks at these things and crawls websites and the more content you have on your website that's relevant to your business you know the more points you're gonna get with Google um, I find that about 1500 uh, words of content on on your website is ideal um, and then obviously if you're looking to beat out competition we want to have more than that so I look at your your website here and roughly 800 to a thousand on the top end uh, for your content um, so we can certainly beef that up a little bit, uh, put some more relative content on there. Google likes to make sure you're giving, you know, customers an informative, um, you know, website so they know what they're looking at. Um, if we, uh, if we jump right into the second thing, um, citations, you're probably not familiar with, uh, what citations are. So a quick thing on that, um, this right here is considered the map pack. So when I type in, um, you know, Green Bay roofing and look at the top three people that come up in the map pack, it's because they have a lot of citations. And citations are simply anywhere out there, like the yellow pages or um, you know any advertising thing that a company has their business name, their phone number, their address. The more times that comes up in relative places, the, the more citations you have. Um, we have a tool that we use to look that stuff up. It's called WhiteSpark. And if you look at this here, you can look at this. It costs about 60 bucks a month to get this program. But I pulled your your business up here. You got about 25 citations, and H&S Roofing's got about 46 citations. So if you go back and you know you type in the keywords like Green Bay Roofing, pretty common keywords, H&S Roofing is number one up here on the citations. Um, so to get up there with them and get yourself on the map pack, um, you're going to want to do about 25 more citations, and uh, you can find yourself relevant on the maps when people type in uh, keywords. Uh, keywords. That's another big thing that kind of goes into the content. The more keywords you have in your content, um, you know, relative keywords to your industry, like Green Bay Roofing or Roofing Green Bay or Green Bay Roofing Contractors, the more times that's in your content, uh, the more relative you're going to be in Google to, to sh you know, pop up on these on these searches. Um, and then the last thing I wanted to show you, Andrew, is uh, is backlinks. And this is a pretty big uh, thing here. If you look at your uh, and the tool I'm using here is AREFs. Uh, this is another one you can get. This one's about 500 bucks a month uh, to pay for. Um, but there is free programs out there that you can get this information on. Um, I just find this to be the most accurate. And as for as much as I use it and the things I do, um, it does a little more uh, for me. But if you look at this, you got uh, backlinks here. You got 82 backlinks. And the biggest thing here is is referring domain. So um, you look at this here, and these are your powers that, you know, I guess the powers that be um, without getting too technical, but this is a hundred point scale. Uh, you want these numbers to be relatively co close to each other and the higher they are, the more power you have on Google. Um, the power is, got, uh, is gotten by getting backlinks and referring domains. So a backlink is anything that um, if you go on other websites and that website has a link that goes back to yours, um, that's considered a backlink. And referring domains is when that backlink goes back there. Um, and actually has some power in there. So if your website shows up on like Pizza Hut's website, um, that's really not a powerful backlink to you because Pizza Hut has nothing to do with the roofing industry. So you want to have backlinks um, out there um, on relevant blogs and uh, other websites and, and things to do with your industry. Okay, so you're, <clears throat> if you look at your competition, I got H&S Roofing up here again. They got 429 backlinks, 55 referring domains, and they're actually bringing in Roughly about 57, uh, uh, or excuse me, the 53 organic traffic uh, searches to their website a month. Um, where if we go back and look at yours, 
you're bringing in about 10 organic searches a month. So you can imagine if you're getting another 40 to 50, you know, prospects going to your website every month, you know, even if you turn two of those into, you know, clients, um, you know, I've worked with enough roofers before to know that, you know, depending on the size of the roof that in your pocket after it's all said and done, you know, you're anywhere from, you know, three to five thousand dollars in profit. So two clients obviously does a lot for you um, at the end of the year. So um, these are all things, Andrew, that you can do uh, to get your website up top of the, you know, top of the Google listings to get more, you know, traffic to you. Um, there's a bunch of other things uh, that I do as a as a company to to make people more relevant. Um, you know, and ads and all that kind of stuff, but I won't get into that. I just wanted to do the short video to give you some free things that you can do to help bolster, you know, and get things up and moving. Um, if you'd like any help with this, I'd be more than happy to extend a hand and we can at least have a chit chat. Um, if you want to reach back out, my number is 920-639-4341. Um, if you have any questions, uh, if anything, if you could just shoot me a text um, or hit me back with an email um, when I send this out, whether it be uh, no thanks or appreciate it or um, that was too long or you know whatever the case may be, I'm always open to, open to feedback. So I uh, appreciate you listening. You have a good rest of the day, and I look forward to hearing from you. Thanks, Andrew. Bye.